Hey guys, Miss Osuna here. Let's do a high heel shoe. So we start off with the horizontal line that represents the ground. And now let's start off with our toe facing the right. And we're coming at a slight curve and then the bottom of our shoe. And now we come up to see how high we want the heel to actually be. Okay, now the back of our high heel. And so now we can do the side of the actual platform shape itself and curving up. All right, so we have our basics. Now we're gonna do the inside of the shoe where your foot would rest. All right, so that's what we have there. And now let's put our strap. So our strap is gonna be thick, comes up and around. Okay, so what I just did here, this is wider. We come up at a curve and these come wider on the bottom here. So it's narrow here, wider at the bottom. Okay, so that's the part where you would slip your foot in at the toe area. And now let's do a second. So I'm going to do the same idea. I'm just making it higher up. And once I get over here to the opposite side of our shoe, I'm just going to make it more narrow. So it's wider here, more narrow there. And then this comes down right to there and there. All right, I'm going to color that in as well so that you can see. These are the straps. And on the opposite side here, same thing. It's wider at the um, bottom, more narrow at the top. All right, so that is a very cute strappy sandal, and that can be version one. Now let's add a little more to it. So if we wanted to add, uh, let's say, a strap here, wider at the bottom and keeping with our theme, more narrow up here at the top. And I'm gonna color this one in just to start. Okay, now this can be a second version. So you can keep these two straps and then you're gonna add this one. So the other strap is going to come to the inside. So I'm gonna curving down wider at the bottom, more narrow at the top, and I'm gonna have them crisscross. One is on top, one's gonna be underneath. So I'm gonna shade that one in as well. All right, so this is the beginning. So now this is the under, this one's on top. So for the under, I'm going to bring it up and over to the right, okay? So this comes up and over towards the right, right to about there maybe a little further, and then a straight line. Okay, I'm gonna color that in, and this is going to end up being the ankle strap that goes around the ankle. So bring that curve up. All right, so now this is on top, this is underneath, and it curves up and around, and I'm just going to now have the one that's on top here. I'm gonna bring this one out and up. So you can see this one. Let me just darken that so you can see it. And now I just need to connect the two right across there. All right, so I made a crisscross situation. I just wanna make sure you got that. Let me pull in, uh-oh, a little too much, hold on, right there. So let me pull right here, okay. This was the darker one, it's underneath, on top, excuse me, and this was a little bit lighter for the shading, and this is underneath. So the one that's underneath curves up here to the right, and the one that was the on top curves over towards the left. So now all I have to do is just bring the rest of that circle around. 
So notice I was on the outer edges and then the inner portion as well. All right, so I'm gonna zoom back out and color that in. So I'm just shading that so you can get a feel for what's happening here. So that gives a little bit more interest to just your average high heel. Okay, so there we are. This comes under and goes around. And now just for that final finishing touch, I will zoom in and just put a little belt buckle. So it's a square. Here's the big close up. This is a square and it has a square on the inside and it has a straight line. That's it. Super simple. I'm going to put that right about here. I'm going to switch over mechanical pencil and we have our buckle action. Two lines and you won't be able to see unless it was a different color, for example all those details because I've shaded the straps just to make sure that you can see the strap detail but there we are we try and darken it a little and that is it this gives you a lot of interest for your high heel shoe we have a double strap we have a nice platform very very high heel we have a crisscross situation happening at the ankle here this one's on top, curving towards the left. This one is underneath and comes around towards the right. And then it finishes off here with a buckle. Um, literally, you won't be able to see the detail, but what would be happening here is inside of that belt buckle, you would see one part of the strap stick out, and then the rest of it would be straight. But you don't see that because it's too small. So really all you would see is that square portion of the buckle and then maybe this prong that would stick out. All right, so that is it for your high heel with a little bit of extra interest. It's a platform, crisscross strap happening, double strap at the front, and I'll see you on the next video.